In Greek mythology, Phaedra was a princess from Crete. Her name, Phaedra, comes from the Greek word Phi Alpha Iota Delta Rho, meaning, bright. As the daughter of Minos and Pesiphae, she became the wife of Theseus. However, Phaedra fell in love with her stepson, Hippolytus. Though she made advances toward him, Hippolytus rejected her advances. As a result, Phaedra accused him of trying to rape her. Theseus then prayed to Poseidon, who responded by killing Hippolytus. Devastated by the consequences of her actions, Phaedra took her own life. Euripides' play Hippolytus, Seneca the Younger's Phaedra, and Ovid's Heroids all tell the story of Phaedra. This tragic tale has inspired countless works of art and literature throughout the ages, including Jean Racine's play. Phaedra, a Greek mythological figure, is a character whose story is widely known through a variety of sources. Though many earlier sources that depicted Phaedra such as plays and poems have been lost over time, works such as Phaedra by Seneca the Younger and the Heroids by Ovid still give us insight into the story. There are many versions of the story of Phaedra and Hippolytus, but they all follow a general structure, with two versions becoming more prominent over time. Version 1 portrays Phaedra as a shameless and lustful wife of the Athenian king, Theseus, while version 2 depicts her as a noble and virtuous queen. However, both versions ultimately lead to a tragic ending for the characters. Phaedra, mother of two sons, Akamas and Demophon, sets her sights on Hippolytus, her stepson and Theseus's son by another woman, in the traditional version of the story. It is not clear why Hippolytus rejects Phaedra, but when he does, she becomes humiliated. Afraid of Theseus finding out, Phaedra lies to her husband that Hippolytus tried to rape her. Outraged, Theseus curses Hippolytus with one of three wishes granted to him by the god of the sea, Poseidon, and requests his son's death. A huge bull rises from the sea, frightening Hippolytus's horses into a frenzy that drags the rider to his death. In some versions of the story, Hippolytus is even named, the one who is torn apart by horses. Eventually, Phaedra's treachery is discovered and, to escape a harsher fate, she takes her own life. In this version of the Phaedra story, she is portrayed as a virtuous queen who becomes caught in the middle of a conflict between Hippolytus and Aphrodite, the goddess of love. Hippolytus, a devout follower of Artemis, vows eternal chastity, which angers Aphrodite. In an attempt to punish Hippolytus, she curses his stepmother, Phaedra, to fall madly in love with him. Phaedra is distraught and depressed for months due to her unrequited feelings for Hippolytus. She confides in her nurse, who tells Hippolytus. Bound by his vow of abstinence, Hippolytus rejects Phaedra, which causes her to fear the consequences of her immoral desires and plan to commit suicide. Before doing so, she writes a letter to her husband, Theseus, accusing Hippolytus of attempting to seduce her, hoping to protect her children from misfortune. Similar to the previous version, Theseus reads the letter and prays to Poseidon to kill his son, which he does by summoning a bull to scare Hippolytus's horses. However, in this version, Artemis reveals the truth to Theseus about Aphrodite's curse on his wife. Theseus is left to grieve the loss of his wife and son.